Almost three years of construction, the Morgan Sullivan Bridge connecting Aguam and West Springfield is finally complete. Today, a ribbon cutting ceremony was held to celebrate. Western Mass News reporter Briseta Landaverde joins us live now in Aguam with community reaction. Briseta. While Jordan, the bridge first opened in April, a year before it was expected to be finished. Now, we spoke to residents who say this is perfect timing ahead of summer and fall activities. So it's nice to see that it's more pedestrian friendly as well. Local Agawam residents excited construction on the Morgan Sullivan Bridge is complete and will make a big difference for crowns heading to and from the Big E Fair at the Eastern States Exposition in less than three months. It looks really nice too. I think it, the whole area just looks better. It's kind of beautified the area, I think. Um, but I mean, the traffic that runs through is a lot smoother. I'm, I'm very happy that the project is coming to a close. The crossover is now widened to four lanes and includes new sidewalks and bike lanes. Agawam Mayor Bill Sapelli tells Western Mass News the bridge will help with foot traffic as thousands attend the fair. Look at this barrier. You got the concrete barrier, uh, the, the fencing. It's just beautiful on the width uh, so that we can get crowds through to and from. The bridge was completed a year earlier than expected. Sapelli says this is thanks to additional funds from the state which wasn't part of the original contract, which expedited the whole process and which allowed us to finish a year early. Another helping factor, the COVID-19 pandemic. The Massachusetts Department of Transportation tells us fewer cars on the road allowed for more work to get done. Put additional resources out on the bridge so that they wouldn't be impacting those type of any kind of interference and really allowed us to get some extra work done. Lieutenant Governor Karen Polito on hand at Thursday's ribbon cutting event, congratulating the efforts made by Aguam and West Springfield in completing this project, calling the effort resilience in infrastructure. Not just for vehicular movements, but pedestrians, cyclists, and making connections uh, within a neighborhood so that more people can move around and coexist uh, in a safer manner. This project being completed is also a huge benefit to local businesses near the area where traffic is now moving much smoother. For now, reporting in Aguam, Priscilla Landa Verde for Western Mass News.